Okay, I figured out a workaround for the um, the strange rendering issues in uh, in Cura. So, if we go over to Cura, I can show you what I'm talking about. Um, if we go to any of the open or save dialog boxes, uh, you can see this, and you can sort of see it as I go up and down here. This sort of black flickering. Um, like if I go to open file, I get this funny black flickering, and if I go to Greg then it kind of, it, it blacks out. And if I hover over things, they sort of come in and out so I can sort of use it, but it's pretty, it's pretty frustrating. So if you want to fix this, um, if you want to fix this, we're going to, we're going to go in and we're going to change a, uh, the GPU support setting for uh, Chrome OS. So the way we're going to do that, we're going to go to Chrome um, and we're going to start a new tab. And we're going to go to uh, to the flags, which are sort of experimental options in Chrome. So we're going to go, we're going to type in Chrome colon slash slash flags slash, and then we're going to do hashtag crustini dash GPU dash support. And I'll put, uh, <clears throat> I'll put this in the description so you can copy and paste it if you want. So if we go here, it's going to highlight for us this Christini GPU support. GPU is the graphics processor unit. Basically, it's the graphics card for the um, for the computer. And it's causing, it's on by default, and it's causing some problems. So what we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to click Disabled. Okay, and it's going to say your changes will take effect the next time you restart your device and you can click restart, but that doesn't work. So um, the key thing is that we have to actually shut the computer down. So if you just do a restart, it doesn't work. I've tried it, but I've learned that if you shut the computer all the way down, let it sit for a second and then start it up again, then it works. So I'm going to do that now. So the way you start, you shut it down, we'll go down to the tray here and we'll hit the shutdown button. Um, and uh, I'm not going to do it right now because it'll interrupt my recording, but just click shut down, let your computer shut down for a minute and then, um, and then start, uh, start back up and uh, reload Cura and we'll see, we'll see how that goes. So I'll stop the video now. All right, I have, uh, as you remember, uh, turned off Christini GPU support and then shut down the computer completely. Not just do a restart, but shut down completely. And then I started back up and I uh, ran Cura here with the dot slash, uh, dot slash Cura dot 461 app image. And Cura is up and running now, you can see here. And uh, if I go to one of the dialog boxes, you can see it's nice and it works just fine. Nothing blacks out. Um, so give that a try um, if, if you're having problems. If you're not having any problems with Cura um, and you're able to use it, great. You don't have to do this. Um, but give this a try if you are having troubles. The, uh, the downside is that you're... Um, uh, your programs might run a little bit slower. Um, they may not, but uh, you may notice that, that the whole system runs a little bit slower since GPU support is off. Um, but uh, let's see, lost lost my video. It's kind of arbitrary whether it does video or not. One of the nice things about this is that if you install other Linux apps, um, like for example, I have Inkscape here, which is a um, open source uh, vector graphics uh, program, a little bit similar to um, Adobe Illustrator, um, that this was not working before I disabled the GPU support, but now you can see that it does work. Um, and I can draw things and I can manipulate them. So uh, this is a way to uh, be able to run Linux apps 
uh, Linux programs on your computer and have the rendering actually work, which uh, just like with uh, with Cura before, those that that screen rendering was not working. So um, again, uh, go to Chrome flags, Christini GPU support, disable it, and then shut your computer all the way down and start it back up. And uh, you should uh, you should have an improved Cura experience. All right, y'all. Let me know if you have questions in the in the Slack.